All right, so. Oh, I didn't see the characters. Yeah, me neither. But we're about to see him now. Oh, yep. So, Kellen. And yeah, Kellen's sure. still on the trainer. So, um, and then of course we've got. Cheer. 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 I'm gonna say cheer. Cheer. <laughs> oh yeah, you're just, yeah. you just in this yeah. <laughs> It's okay. So yeah, cheer. Snake's back on the screen with it, the same exact matchup. Are you sure? Cheer. Cheer. No, cheer. I, I was really bad at English. Now you make me self-conscious about Okay, it's, it's Chur, it's Chur, it's Chur. It's Chur. It has okay. to be, right? Because Chur is like C-H-E-R. Yeah, it, he would use the actual word Chur, you know, right? Right. He would. Right. Uh, whatever. Anyway, <laughs> this matchup's back, and you're saying that you, oh, you're saying that you think Ivysaur does the best versus Snake. Um, I, I don't know which Pokemon does the best versus Snake, but I know Ivy body Snake in disadvantage because up air just is so huge, so it can be harder to be reverse around, and you're going to hit, like, Snake's legs. Mm -hmm. And even if you detonate the grenade, the, the up air is so disjointed, like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. This should be a, oh, okay, he tried to, Kellen tried to set it up, but the double jump kind of brought him above the ledge, so even if he got the spike, he might have probably just ended up on stage. Now, Kellen, oh, ooh. there it was. He caught his double jump immediately, tried to do, like, the, the, the autopilot Snake landing, just double jump C4. Well, C4, then double jump, yeah, yeah. 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 And then everyone, like, for some reason, doesn't like read the jump. But Kellen read the jump there. Got the stock. Oh the yeah, Ivysaur. I forgot Razor Leaf blows up grenade too. That's yeah. good. See, like with that, I would assume Ivy does like really good in neutral, or at least like you can definitely play the keep away game against Snake. Oof. Look there at all this damage. Yeah, he's taking. so much. But that's Snake. He's, it, when he's in a uh, general situation, oh, jeez. I feel but like he could have avoided that. But he definitely could have avoided that because right when he got hit off stage, he blew up the C4. I think that was very greedy from Chirp. He need, you just need a double jump high, like go high. Because at least like at that percent that he was at, he wouldn't have died from an Ivysaur uh, up air. You know what I mean? Yeah. And the nerfs up B isn't going to kill him either. Right. So it's like you're definitely going to die from sweet spot down air. Ooh. That was very unfortunate. You got hit by the up tilt and the grenade. Yeah, you got added insult to injury. Yeah, and the up tilt was the last one that hit him on the way out. So yeah. the one, the killing one, was the one that hit last. So unfortunate, but very well timed from Chur. Ooh, the water gun set up the switch into Ivy. Ooh, just maybe didn't have enough time to do it. Yeah, he started it really late. Yeah, but that is a common setup. Just get the. The water gun to hit him out the jumps and then just down air the recovery. Yeah, yeah. With Ivy Sore. It's gonna be so good. And the water gun can be particular. Oh wow, you can crouch under a razor leaf. That's that's big. Yeah, honestly, I know you can kinda angle the razor leaf, right? No, I don't think you can. Really? I thought you could make it like go up and down. Like I've I've never seen that. Like a little bit? I don't know. I think Snake's crouch is just that good. Yeah, probably. Reverse? No, you're just gonna Ball straight down and through the platform. That was a really good mix-up. Yeah, you got to mix up your lanes with Snake, especially versus Ivysaur. Otherwise, it's going to eat so much punishment every time you try to get back to the ground. Okay, now Kellen's got to watch these grenades now. He's starting to take some really bad trades. Up tilt could is definitely going to kill him, yeah, too, with all this rage. Yeah, that's why we see the switch to Zard. Ooh. Doesn't want to risk it. Okay. You have the grenade coverage uh, up tilt? a little bit. Oh, oh, no sweet spot, though. Yeah. You, you, you saw the roll-in, though. It's the ledge trap. Wow, the cypher up throw, not down throw. Yeah. Uh, I think down throw at forward tilt would have connected there. Probably wouldn't have killed, but. Yeah, right now, Kellen definitely looking for some kind of out of shield option. Charizard, a character that plays very well out of shield. You have up smash and grab out of shield, so both of those will definitely seal out this stock, but right now, Chur is not making it easy yeah, he's for this uh, big body. Setting up the minefield. Like, oh, oh, there's the yeah. oh, he whiffed that grab. Got dash a bit yeah, yeah. He, he he definitely just felt. I mean, to be fair, we saw Kellen showing a lot of shield. Like Kellen was run shield, run shield, run shield. Like the last like five times he dashed, he was like shielding. So I, I I thought that was like pretty good conditioning. Kellen goes for like a full hop, tries to fade back, react. Saw that he went for the dash grab, came down with the claws. That was a very close game though. Yeah. Definitely not close. a three stock. Yeah, I, I called. It. Yeah. <laughs> Show right. side bit, man. Damn. Right. You, you shook me when you, like, saw who the players were, <laughs> and, like, I, I couldn't see. So, like, man, he probably knows it's, like, it's like some top players. 
Yeah, I don't think there should be a character switch here. It was a really close game. No, no, I don't think anyone's going to switch. Oh, but we are going to have Battlefield and I know uh, most snakes. Ooh, yes, the song is so good. Yeah, break the targets. For you. Melee break the targets. All right, right? I'm pretty sure this is the melee break the targets. Jeez. Much forward areas. Ooh, nice. Covers a roll in from the down throw. It's wow. I thought Kellen definitely uh, crossed him up with that air dodge drift in, but did not get past his arms right there. Sure got the grab. Now, Squirtle, oh, yep. Yeah, nice I was right surprised out. he stayed on Squirtle that long, to be honest. I mean, you can, depends on uh, how much you love Squirtle, but I, even like Tweak will stay on Squirtle for quite a long time. It depends on how comfortable you are with him. Yeah. Because you are still small, you know what I mean? Ooh. Dang, that almost killed Snake at 109. Yeah, that was, oh. Oh, the, no, that's so unfortunate. Oh, he, he was a little bit close to the ledge. That would have blown up that neutral get up, and instead he's going to die first. Yeah, off the switch. Sucks. They're gonna switch right to the Ivy Sword. Okay. Yeah. He's like, all right, this is my character versus Snake. I'm, I'm just gonna go Ivy. Oh, up tilt. Just the grab. Oh, but you uh, got. Yeah. You can't we don't, it. we don't like these trades right now. If you're Ivy Sword. That, that's oh. one thing about uh, Snake pulling grenade. If you go up and you dash grab a Snake that has a grenade in hand, do not pummel. Just throw, and because sometimes the pummel will blow, blow up the grenade. But Kellen with the down air onto that cipher. Yeah, uh, easy kill there. They nerfed that move, by the way. They they made the sweet spot uh, smaller. So the move is still strong. You just yeah. got to, it's like not as quote unquote easy to do. And I mean, it just hits still like so much that <laughs> I right. just think it's so funny. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, wow. That was a great no. punish coming out for sure. Yeah, and you went to 14? Oh, that's barely anything if you're Snake. Yeah, and Snake with a lead like this. That's when it gets really rough because Snake can just force like these trade situations. Exactly. No double jump though. Oh wow, no switch to the Ivy Sword. Just gonna opt to stay with the Squirtle there. Yeah, I don't know. I, he just hasn't really seemed that comfortable with, with Squirtle in this matchup. That's why I'm kind of surprised he stays on Squirtle so much. His, his Ivy Sword definitely is doing I mean, the his, best. His Squirtle is getting the damage. Oh, tried to call out the uh, jump, but yeah. sure jumped backwards with the jump, so the up air did not connect. Yeah, I thought the vine whip was coming after that back air. Oh, Ooh, the wow. setups, man. Oh, this is this is a rough scenario to be in. Oh, and he caught the reel in immediately, too. Yeah, he, like, pre-positioned that as well. Yeah. So, sure, definitely looking very comfortable on Battlefield. We'll see if Kellen can make the adjustments here. I'll be honest. If if I'm Kellen, I'm starting Ivy Sword. Starting Ivy Sword. Yeah. Real? I, I think his Squirtle's doing fine. I think so. Yeah. I, I think he just, I think in, there are situations for Kellen that he needs to switch into Ivy faster. Like that in the last game where he hit him out of his double jump with Squirtle. Yeah. After, that, like, yeah. you just go Ivy Sword. Once yeah. the double jump's gone, go Ivy and then just try to kill him. Yeah, exactly. Because then at that point he has way less mix ups. There's just the directional air dodge mix up. But did you know that uh, Kellen runs uh, False Swipe Gaming? What's that? The, a YouTube channel. What's it about? Uh, it does it does a lot of uh, Pokemon content, but he's he started doing Smash content too. Like, have you ever seen that? Like videos of like, oh, you ever wonder like, what this Pokemon was like in competitive throughout all the different gens of games and stuff like that. It's really it's a very popular channel. It has a lot of uh, subscribers and stuff. So, pretty big channel. Popular YouTuber Kelly. Yeah, that's really cool. Any any plays Pokemon channel. And he, uh, and he started to do um, Smash videos. So it's like, uh, I think the last one he came out, or he has one for Fox where it's like, what was Fox and like, what was the Fox meta like every game? Like oh. Smash 64, Melee, Brawl. That's interesting. Actually. Yeah, it's, it's super cool. I, I, lo I love watching the videos. But right now, Kellen down a stock right now against Chur. But Chur, I mean, he's at 128. Definitely. Oh, Dirk Jr. Air Dodge. Oh, Gets yeah. to the Razor Leap. Another one. Can he catch the up air? Wow, and Chur just like sinks down really, really quick. Oh, nice wow, that, I'm so surprised that up air didn't connect. Oh, okay. there it is. Caught the jump from the platform. Oh, oh man. It's like so much percent. It's so unfortunate because I feel like he was doing a really good job of avoiding all these explosives, on, especially on that last stock. Yeah, I like the spacing of the race loop now. He's just catching with the grenade pulls, but a great crouch there. Oh, man, and oh. see, like. 
Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, man. He's so fortunate he didn't get stage spiked by that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, like my Zard God. is coming out. Try to go for the back air. Ooh. He's trying to make this Zard stock like count for everything he's worth. Oh, he didn't get baited there, so that was good. Yeah, the, it's, uh, Nikita drops up, so it works on a lot of people. Oh, why are you Squirtle at this percent? You're a madman. And Squirtle is hard to hit. Okay, straight for the Ivy, though. Grabs a grenade, throws it. Right, I mean, Kellen has the rage, goes for the dash grab. This yeah, back throw should do it. So oh, yeah, oh, yeah. He's out of here. You also have that confirmed. <laughs> yeah. He needs it. <laughs> he doesn't need it. He doesn't need it. So but we're, we're glad he has it if you are a snake main. Oh, oh free punish. punish? Oh, no, oh, no that way. Because he was crouching off the Nikita. That's why yeah, he didn't get hit by the rising bear. Yeah, his profile That's actually was much such, lower such a specifically weird situation. <laughs> I, that's so sad. Damn, that sucks. For that to happen like in tourney, that sucks. And sure is definitely uh, running away with this last stock Ooh. here. Kellen needs to find an answer really soon. I'll be honest, I don't, I don't think Smashville was the play versus Snake. This is such a good Snake stage. Counter? Ooh. Thought he was going to go high, but um, opting to go with the directional air dodge. There's the pummel again. Yeah. You can't pummel versus Snake with the grenade. Oh, and now Cher's swinging the up till he, he knows it'll kill if it connects. Oh, bad trade. He didn't hit him, and he got blown up. Oh, no, he needs to land on the ground. Oh, watch the C4. He's putting so much pressure on him right now. Oh, he wanted to back air him, though. What are you going to do? Oh, you can't get past that Nikita. Just side into his doom. So, like, it's rough. does he lose the armor? Like, what's happening there? Or did that 